cross hand grab and two hand grab. In all of the previous examples, Linda's right wrist was being held by the attacker's left hand. What happens when the attacker reaches across with his right hand and grabs her right wrist? You can use some of the same techniques that we used before. First, step in and pull your hand straight up over your shoulder. Or else, you can circle around the outside of his wrist and break free. Look at Master Kim's hand as he executes these escapes. His fingers are extended and his hand is stiff. You ought to imitate this. We don't want to go into a lot about martial arts, so there's no need for a long explanation. Just practice holding your hand like this when your wrist is grabbed. Let's watch Master Kim and his assistant demonstrate this technique properly. If someone grabs your wrist with both of his hands, you can still escape quickly and easily. Again, step in and pull your hand straight up and over your shoulder or else step in and pull it straight down. While you practice this, try to improvise the attacks you will use to disable the attacker. Don't try to be creative. Just let the attack flow naturally from whatever position you find yourself in after the escape. The more natural and comfortable you feel, the more effective your attack will be. From this view, you can see the hold clearly. Watch this carefully. <laughs> 